All right, guys. Um, now that we went over the. All right, guys. Next, we're gonna be talking about anchors. I wanted to make a whole video about just anchors because anchor system is very important. First, you're gonna need is anchor system for yourself. All right. So make sure you guys get one of these. You can actually use some nylon um, strings to use it, but if you have the cash, go get yourself, a, I think these are $35 Metodius one, and you put it through your loop, and this is, you can use this as a self harness where you anchor yourself into, you know, whatever your, you know, whenever you get down into your routes. All right guys, next we want to talk about anchors. I wanted to make a whole video about anchors because I think anchor system is very important. Um, let's talk about that anchor system, but let first let's talk about our self anchor system, all right? I if when I first started um, by purchasing things, I did not have too much money like I said, and so what I did was I was using some nylon strings as an anchor and it worked out fine. The killer news everything worked out fine. But it was kind of inconvenient because I would have to make knots and do all that stuff. So whenever I got a chance, I went and bought me one of these notorious um, self-anchor devices. Um, it's very convenient. Very, very convenient. I just put it on. It has different lengths for different sizes. So I went and bought for that. I believe these was about $35. But um, that's it for about the self-anchor system. Okay, now for the anchors now, you're looking to... Depends on your budget or not. If you're low on budget, I would suggest you, when I told you to buy the quick draws, you pr most likely the rod's gonna have seven, eight, nine, and you might have a couple extra quick draws left. You can use those as your anchor system to get up and down. Now, let me tell you guys something about uh, um, when you get up to the anchor system or to the boats or wherever you guys are trying to get, get up to. Do not use the boats and other stuff that's on there to going up and down on it. Uh, try to use your system much as you can because there's people that are out there that's actually donating their money and time to build these stuff for us and we want to make it last not just for us but for maybe our you know the next generation that's going to be coming climbing so I want you to be very aware of that so make sure you guys always using your equipment to go use it to, to put your rope through unless it's the emergency or whatever you need but just just know that make sure you use your your own system and not use the system that's at the with the boat, right? So we're gonna move on. So you can use the quick draws to opposite oppose. You're gonna put boat boat. You can tie like this. I'm not trying to get too much into it because this is just to, I'm letting you guys know what kind of gears you need. You can use two boats for an anchor system, or you can buy yourself some static rope, real small static rope. And use that for it um, when I started when I got all my gears and I started having some stuff buying things here and there I got myself a little blue water blue wave um, anchor system and I built it for myself and that's where when you build something for yourself like this this is where the where it comes in handy to have extra carabiners because you're gonna need those extra carabiners to Gonna need those extra carabiners to use use it for your anchors but from right now you are just trying to climb and i think the best safe safest thing to do is use the quick draws because it's very easy convenient and it, it very rarely can make a mistake make sure you guys are opposite of post that you know that's all you need to do um uh, far as these anchor system goes what i you, you can see what i did was over here was These two goes on a boat. I will use this to put it in here. And then I would use the carabiner on the bottom to run my rope through. But um, that's it for the ropes. I mean, for the anchor system, you can build it. The most common thing for you to do, easy thing to do is if you're just learning, use the quick draws. Mm. Make sure you guys take this very seriously. You can use these any kind of strings that you can get, make sure they're static. Just make sure you study on this anchor system, especially obviously if you're watching this video, you're learning to how to lead and you wanna take other people out there with you and just think about this. 
you, you're going to build an anchor for yourself, not just for yourself, but the other people that you bring with you. And you don't want to put their life in danger by, you know, kind of skipping three things, you know. So make sure you guys study about this. I personally will put out a video explaining a lot of detail how to make the right anchor and opposite of pose. And, oh, there's so many things to it. I just, we're talking about the beginning right now, so I'm going to talk about that, but make sure you guys study a lot about this. Don't just go up there thinking that you know what you're doing because you're not putting your life in danger, you're putting other people's life in danger, and I think that's important, right? Um, that's it for now, um, and stay tuned for the next video, alright guys?